with TNN Media. My name is Molly Concialdi. And I'm Kenya Aguirre. Welcome to a new school year, Trailblazers, and good luck on your new classes. Back to School Night, an event to introduce students and parents to AACT will be Wednesday the 30th from 5.30 to 7.30 p.m. Parents will meet with teachers and a car wash will be held to fundraise for Senior Sunrise. Be sure to come to this annual event. On the 28th, freshmen, leadership, and mentors will be having a free welcome breakfast. This takes place at 7.30 a.m. to 8.30 a.m. in the restaurant. This marks the second year of the mentor program, which helps new students transition into high school. With more information is Logan Rudder and Patricia Takimoto. The freshman mentor program has always had the goal of making the transition from middle school to high school easier. But how are they making it easier? And what other goals do they have in mind? I'm Logan Rudder reporting for Trailblazer News. Well, basically it's just for um, to the freshmen to have some way to like readapt to like a new like routine and just adapt to like the high school like kind of like area that or like experience because seeing that we are not a normal high school is kind of harder to like go to ACT than any other high school because all the classes we take and so kind of transforming or like transitioning from middle school to like this high school is really hard so what we try to do is basically try to limit that and limit their like difficulties and try to make them more social as well. The changes that are happening to the program is that it's a lot more structured. Uh, the other program coordinators and I and Ms. Eisenberg worked together so that it was a lot more it was a lot more structured and so that way we can help students out better. Well, last year one of our main achievements was that we like the freshman class last year had the best grades ever compared to like other previous freshman classes because last year was the first year we had the mentor programs. So this year our main thing is to have more of the freshmen feel like they have a place here. The goal of the freshman mentor program is to help the freshmen adapt. The mentors are hoping to achieve many things as well while the freshmen are having mixed feelings on the whole mentorship. I wanted to become a freshman mentor because I feel like it would be a really really good experience especially with working with younger kids but not too young just so we could help these kids out and make sure they had someone they could go to in case anything was wrong. I'm hoping to help the freshmen by just giving them a friend, basically, making sure they're on task and making sure that their first year in actual high school is good. I think that it'll really help the transition from middle school to high school because of how different middle schools are. I mean, my middle school barely had any homework and not a lot of classes, so I think that the mentorship will really help freshmen transition into that change. This year's freshman mentor program is hoping to achieve a more unified class, while the mentors are personally hoping to get to know the freshmen. The freshmen themselves are feeling excited and they're looking forward to the 2017-2018 school year. I'm Logan Rudder, reporting for Trailblazer News. Students, please be sure to follow school dress code. Torsos and shoulders must be covered at all times, and skirts and shorts must reach at least mid-thigh in length. The back hallway located near the nurse's office is not for student use. Please enter and exit in the front of the building. Also remember to park in student designated parking spots and that senior parking is on the right side of the building and to be courteous to their spots. Academy days are meant to showcase each academy's personalities and interests. Here's Shelby Fenyas, Paige Oberholzer, and Kylie Lauren on what makes these academy days so special. Hello and welcome to TNN Media. My name is Shelby Fenyas. In the next two weeks, AACT will be celebrating Academy Days. Academy Days are meant to showcase the personalities and interests of our fellow student body. Academy Days are important because we try to involve the freshmen and that's one of like our big goals at our school here. By having those Academy Days, it's a couple of reasons that makes it important. The freshmen um, get to see where um, all the academies are. They get to see what kids are in each academy, make friends with kids in their own academy, or kind of see what their classmates are involved in. And then also, the whole reason people come here is to pick an academy. And so they get to kind of show pride and dress up in um, their academy's theme and involve themselves in the activity at lunch and just really show pride in, in their academy and what they came to this school for. Celebration days are filled with dressing up and lunchtime activities based on AACT's academies. The Education Academy's dress up day is Disney themed and at lunch we're going to do Disney karaoke. Academy celebration days are important because it lets the other academies and everyone else get to know the different academies because normally I feel like education, not a lot of people really understand it or like know who's in it. So it's cool to like let everyone know what's going on. Our academy day is ties and tutus. And our lunchtime activity is ice cream sundaes with a twist. 
I think it's important to celebrate Academy Days because it's kind of what our school was built around and it's important for us to celebrate what makes us different from other high schools. And participating in dress up days and lunchtime activity really gives everyone a chance to show their school spirit and celebrate what makes AACT so special. Oh, the importance of Academy Day is to show Academy pride and we it really let, makes us value our Academy so much more when we celebrate them. Academy Celebration Days will be held August 14th through the 24th. Make sure to dress up and show your school spirit. I'm Shelby Fenias for TNN Media. Have a great day. Thank you, Shelby. On another note, a couple of national CTSO competitions took place where many students took time away from their summer to compete. Kenya Aguirre and I have the scoop. Hi, I'm Kenya Aguirre from TNN. Over the summer, a number of national CTSO competitions took place where many students from AACT participated. One of these competitions, FBLA, has students from all over the world competing besides AACT. The competition went great. We had a great time. Uh, we didn't end up winning any national awards, but we're really proud of our project. Uh, we actually got a lot of opportunities outside of the competition to present our project. So it's really involved. Like the competitions take a lot of work, a lot of preparation. So I'm really happy to see my work pay off. Not only do the students compete, but they also visit local attractions where the competition takes place. We met with um, a man named Shane who is an animator for Disney and he's coming out with a TV show in 2018. So we did a tour of his studio and learned about the television making process because our competition, Publication Design, was about creating a TV show this year, so it connected really nicely. Another competition AACT participated in was Skills USA, which was held in Louisville, Kentucky. A number of groups competed in things such as television production and opening and closing ceremony. We always go to represent, like ACT is always there. Since like CTSOs are kind of our sports, you know, you always go there and you see like a lot of people cheering out for your school. Lacey Gardner, Diego Hernandez, Alyssa Catalano, and Kirsten Countryman are going to FFA this October. Good luck! I'm Kenya Aguirre from TNN, signing off. Senior Sunrise will be on September 8th from 6.15 to 8 a.m. Catering from IHOP will be provided to each and every student. Thanks for watching. From TNN Media, I'm Kenya Aguirre. And I'm Molly Comtialdi. Make sure to check us out on YouTube where we'll be posting informational videos throughout the school year. See you next time!